Tell me about yourself. Hi, my name is Niklas Janborg and I'm currently studying art at Prague College. Uh, it's a bachelor's honors in uh, fine art and experimental media. It's putting me to great challenges, facing uh, uh, learning and understanding new media and um, yeah, it's a, it's a good challenge and I I like um, I like my classmates and uh, it's uh, sad to be in this corona times where we can't see each other as much uh, but more about me I'm uh, considering myself a polyathlete I'm done some skateboarding I also climb, climbing, rock climbing, and uh, mainly parkour, and uh, also some capoeira, and uh, I enjoy moving my body. Um, How would you describe yourself as an artist? Um, I'm foremost a painter, but I'm also trying to incorporate the my what do you call it movement body movement body movement okay thank you uh, uh, and uh, yeah i guess it's like a natural progression to performance but also thinking about how i can incorporate uh, our new media that we have in the our popular culture And that was like the, a lot of the challenges I was talking about. What are your interests and passion next to the sport and art? I have uh, two annoying cats that I love with all my heart. And what's left of my heart, it's uh, love that goes to my fiance uh, behind the camera. Hello! <laughs> In front of the camera. <laughs> She supports me a great deal. Uh, I heard you made some research about uh, flavors and taste. Yes, uh, so that research was basically to prove that uh, taste pleasure is not an excuse for uh, harming animals or eating them like a crazy person. No, it's just uh, ignorance and uh, uh, before that, in the school, I was uh, told to do social and political art, and that was quite challenging because I think most the art I've been doing is painting, and if it looks good, it's it's good, and uh, it can have like a connotation or a concept behind it that makes it good and that can be political or social but uh, yeah so I did art trying to promote veganism and uh, this was like followed up with this research yeah now I recently rediscovered Andy Goldworthy and I like how he's uh, working with nature and how that has a consequence of being uh, a temporary, all his work, and also how he becomes a student of nature. I also like um, uh, Matthew Silver, who is a great uh, performer and uh, really taking like the spiritual side to to every day uh, and that's really admirable and also Matthew Barney is a obviously a great artist uh, I like to I guess my surroundings 
uh, if it's urban or nature or people and influence uh, but uh, I'm trying to have the surrounding that I like and uh, I prefer nature that's why I'm sitting here I guess it would be nice to have uh, my own little resort with the residency and I can invite the uh, artist maybe my parkour career and uh, I did this famous uh, jump between uh, two buildings uh, it's called manpower yes, I'm quite proud of it can show it now in the clip um, it took me a long time to like call myself a vegan uh, and like really make the transition because I didn't like the label and like whatever like if you're a feminist you have all these labels that comes with it or if you're a vegan you have all these labels or if you're left or if you're right or liberal or conservative but with any isms there's like branches to it and uh, anything but uh, it's just to not cause unnecessary harm and uh, it's the ethics of the future trying to find a true expression if it's in painting or body movement yeah i guess i'm trying to like it's like because it's not a question about art but no, it's, a, exactly. it's, it's supposed it's to be about, about me what do you like what would you say to the humanity if you would have the whole population listening for five minutes? I would tell them that they need to stop eat animals. Fishes, cows, sheep, whatever living sentient being. And why? We put the animals we are eating into a living hell on this earth they're causing zoonotic diseases and we're currently experiencing the consequences of coronavirus 19. this is only because our unfathomable creation of animal industry farming And something that go vegan. <laughs> go vegan. <laughs> <laughs> what superpower would you like to have? <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> I would be enlightened because that's the best superpower. <laughs>